Welcome to the video by DJSBRC. What I wanted to show you guys today is the Spectrum Smart Batteries. Basically, what are they? What do they do? And why is everybody wants or want the Smart Battery? Very simple. The smart batteries that Spectrum came out is basically if you charge them and kind of forget about them, you don't need to worry about putting them in storage mode. Now there's a lot of people out there will say a little bit different on when are you supposed to put them in storage mode, things like that. Uh, me personally, after seven days, um, if they not use my battery. I'll put it in storage mode. Storage mode is roughly about 50% of its capacity. Uh, you could say three point. Uh, again, there's a lot of people saying different stories. Uh, some will say oh, 3.4 per cell, uh, 3.5, 3.6, 3.7. It's basically it's what you're comfortable with it. I just go roughly about 50% of its capacity. Um, and yeah now with the smart batteries what is fun once you program them with a smart spectrum charger or even the battery tester you programming this chip right here this is out of a smart battery that died on this chip basically it knows let's say after 72 hours you program this battery 72 hours i did not use you i did not charge you start slowly putting yourself in its storage mode now basically at the end of 72 hours the battery slowly will come down in voltage by itself by the chip here will discharge it slowly uh, and this chip at the same time gives a lot of information stores information should i say about the battery how many times you charged it how many times you cycled it uh did you bring one of the cells lower than it's supposed to um or have you overcharged it things like that still an awesome chip this is uh, one of the smart batteries i have here this is another one this is basically dead um i just wanted to show you guys and to be able to open it and show you where is the physical chip hidden. Now, I cannot stress this enough. Do not do this when I'm doing to a battery. Uh, if the battery has voltage left in there, this could be extremely dangerous. Please do not attempt to do this. You could say in a sense, I'm a trained professional. Now, you'll notice like there's aluminum here. That's just to protect the battery itself. And I'm just gonna cut it right here. And we'll just be able to kind of peel it. And there's the chip. Now on the chip, you'll have basically your main leads to the balancing. We'll go to the chip too. And this is your main power. And this is basically what talks to the charger and the charger to the chip. It's this lead right here. Well taped in, that's for sure. Yeah. Uh, these leads go directly to every cell and in one of each at each every cell two at the same time. Basically somebody could remove this and put it back on a normal battery that's not a smart and be able to use it that's always possible that's something i might look into it in your future with this one or even this one here we'll see 
And this is the uh, Spectrum Smart battery chip. Again, this controls the, uh, the discharge rate, um, but not the discharge rate, should I say. Once you program it, it will slowly discharge itself at the amount. You can even tell it to do it in 30 days, uh, 24 hours, and 18 hours. It's basically you decide with the charger. Now I do have a video how to program this chip. Uh, I'll try to remember to link it down below. Now, if you guys have any questions or comment, please post down below. I'll be glad to answer you guys. And don't forget to hit that bell notification to not be notified next time I upload a video. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.